Israel, located in the Middle East, has been undergoing a substantial construction boom, characterized by the emergence of numerous half-built high-rise buildings that dominate the skyline. Despite not being the typical countries associated with massive construction projects such as the UAE, Qatar, or Saudi Arabia, Israel has established itself as a global hub for innovation, attracting tech giants such as Microsoft and numerous startups. With a growing population and increasing demand for larger buildings and infrastructure, the construction industry has had to adapt to keep up with the workload. Fortunately, technology is leading the way and construction in Israel is gathering some serious speed. The construction trend is evident across the country, with cranes sprouting up in all directions. Between July 2021 and June 2022, more than 72,000 homes began construction in Israel, the highest figure since the 1990s when the country experienced a wave of immigration from the former Soviet Union. The reasons for this new construction push are similar to those from 30 years ago. Israel's population is soaring, and the country needs more homes and infrastructure to support them. At the end of 2022, the country had almost 9.7 million residents, an increase of 2 million in just over a decade. Since there is not much space in the main cities, most of the new housing is being delivered as high-rises. Although Israel has fewer actual skyscrapers than other countries in the region, the Israeli spiral tower in Tel Aviv is set to become the country's first super-tall skyscraper when it completes in 2026, with a planned height of 350 meters. Designed by Cohn Peterson Fox, the building is a mixed-use structure, with retail on the base, followed by offices, residences, and a hotel with the floor plates gradually narrowing as the tower rises. The infrastructure side has also seen significant progress, with Tel Aviv's new mass transit system being the largest and most complex transport project in Israel's history. The system consists of three light rail and three metro lines, with the first due to open in April 2023. The route will run from Batyam in the south to several smaller cities on the outskirts of Tel Aviv, like BNEI Brak. The built environment is changing rapidly in other areas as well. In Herzliya, near Tel Aviv, a new auditorium for Reichman University is proving challenging to construct, and the consulate towers in Jerusalem are being built in an area with unusually difficult terrain. HYP, a joint project between Ahmad Investments and Allied Real Estate is a 52-story building that will offer 85,000 square meters of office and commercial space. Buildings across Israel are not just increasing in number and getting taller, they are also becoming more complex. In conclusion, Israel's construction boom is a response to a rapidly growing population and increasing demand for larger buildings and infrastructure. With technology leading the way, the country is adapting to the workload and making significant progress in building new structures. High-rises are becoming more common, and Tel Aviv's new mass transit system is the largest and most complex transport project in Israel's history. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like and subscribe to Wonderful Stories. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.